Imagine it's a scorching hot afternoon and your office aircon fails. Then you get a call from home. It's failed there too. And the fridge just stopped working. Not very cool. We need cooling to live comfortably and in good health. But it's just more than just comfort. Temperatures are rising across the globe and existing cooling technologies are antiquated, energy intensive and use synthetic refrigerants which worsen the climate change. Energy unique cooling technology uses 70% less electricity and uses plain water as a refrigerant. Cooling is produced through evaporation. The technology uses thermal compression with adsorption of the refrigerant onto nanoporous material. This process uses low-grade waste heat, not electricity, as the energy source. We use an innovative design to manage this thermal process without conventional energy-intensive mechanical compression. Our team has a strong and competent technical core of passionate young engineers and experienced adsorption scientists. We will target a $40 billion market, about 35% of a $100 billion cooling market. We are targeting industrial, public and commercial buildings, industrial, including hospitals, district cooling plants, and also data centers. Energy's cooling saves significant electricity costs. A 50-ton chiller unit can save $40,000, for example, annually with average North American ele electricity cost. Capital costs are recovered within two to three years, depending on the electricity rates and duration of the use. We have built two working prototypes and are pilot testing a five-ton chiller at a data center in Toronto. We will carry out two large-scale demonstration 50-ton units and then design, manufacture, and commercialize the final product. We have the right blend of innovation and experience to turn our plans into reality.